Hey everybody, this is Team Ninja Awesome, and we are back with our Dark Souls playthrough. Um, we cut it last time, as you can see, not a whole lot has changed from our positions, just because we cut it strictly to split the video into a separate part. Um, right now, as I'm going to get back my souls, um, Eric is going to teach you guys a little bit about weapons and... Dark Souls weapons and you, is what we're going to call this. Oh, uh, really? Okay. Uh, this is Andre. You've met him before. He's our nice bearded friend. You have to talk to him. You go down to reinforce weapon, right? And I've been using the halberd. I don't have any souls. Uh, so this tutorial is shit. But where'd your souls go? Oh, show him how to use the items. Okay. So you put these items in your thing. Press your item button, whatever it is, and you get some souls. The number goes up by 200. It's nice. Um, then you you'll, uh, you'll have different size souls depending on, or the names are, uh, there's different types of souls. Some give you 200, some give you 1,000. Some give you, like, a million. That's a rough estimate and also not accurate. Um, <laughs> just playing wrong. Anyway. Yeah, way out of ballpark. But, um, so each what? one gives you a different amount. Right. So learn what they are, and we teach you, but I forget the names. <laughs> So what I did in there, I used a Titanite. Oh, there's the guy that killed us. Mm -hmm. Anyway. Wait, what? The, he was hanging out by the bonfire. Anyway, uh, I used a Titanite to upgrade this weapon. So now it's the Halberd plus one. Now that number can go as high as 15 if uh, there's a series of things you got to do to let it get that high. But Which we'll go over. Just know that with regular Titanite that we collected... Uh, you can get this up to plus five, which will get you through, I don't know, the first part of the game pretty well. Now, this halberd is what I'm going to be using for this. What? I'm sorry. No, I just recreated the scene from uh, Terminator 2 Judgment Day. The girls on the swings and the atomic... Never no, Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Roll the clip. Wasn't that something? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> anyway. No, you got it. <laughs> so as I was doing, saying, uh, this fucking, this is the halberd. Uh, if you'll take a look at here and here, you get to see the weapon scaling. Now that refers to, oh, go back. What happened? Oh, no. Anyway, that refers to the first one is strength, the second one is dexterity, the third one is magic or in magic and then faith intellect and then faith uh so if you see this is dc for strength and uh dexterity respectively so if we go to my status as i upgrade my strength and dexterity this weapon is going to do more damage uh those letters go all the way up to s because the japanese alphabet starts with s and then goes down to uh, no it does not <laughs> I know. <laughs> so it goes S, A, B, C, D, E, I think, with E being the worst, obviously. So you want to kind of, if you choose a weapon that you like a whole bunch and want to stick with, you start upgrading stats accordingly. So that weapon will do more damage. So I'm going to run back to the bonfire to summon Phil. We're going to get ganked again. It's going to be a f fun time. Son of a f fun time. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. The Great Axe dropped for me already. The Great Axe? Where'd you get the yeah, Great Axe? I don't know. Uh, I did not know I could get that before uh, D-Town. B-Town? Detail. It's in the depth. Oh yeah, you're right. Anyway, put well, down depths. your summon sign in that place so I can run there and get it real quick without getting invaded. Okay, let me see if I can equip the Great Axe yet. No. Yeah, it probably <laughs> needs a lot of strength. <laughs> yes. Yes, sir, I do. Th huh. <laughs> <laughs> what? 32. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little off. Uh, <laughs> I think you got it. Do 
Alright, so uh, this time I'll show you what you have to do. Um, in order to see summon signs, you have to be human. Uh, or not hollowed, whatever you want to call it. However, to place your summon sign, you can be hollow like I am. Uh, you'll see I have my white summon stone, which you get from talking to Solaric. You have to talk to Solaric to get it. Uh, just say yes to everything he tells you. Well, to you, you could kill him too, but you could. don't do that. Don't do that. I mean, do it if you want. We're not here to tell you how to run your life. We're not your real dad. Except for you, Adrian. What? Pop us home. I'm sorry I had to find out like this. I... <laughs> Also, anyway, <laughs> Adrian is probably not you. You're safe. Uh, <laughs> Different Adrian. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you're you're good. Except you, Adrian. I am talking to you. Um, you anyway, now that we've upgrades. completely switched off of what we should be talking about. What are we? Uh, oh, Dark Souls. Uh, <laughs> what was I just talking about? Just put down your summon sign okay. so people can see uh, how to do it. You'll see. I have it in my quick launch. After talking to Solaire, you'll have it. Or killing Solaire. Don't do that. Uh, go to where you want to put it. If it's not grayed out, you can use it. Pop that bitch down. Shablam. Stand here. Strike a pose. Like this. Like this. Like this. Yeah. Yeah. Are you proud yeah. of what you're doing? No. <laughs> yeah. Not proud of that either. Okay. Uh, now you'll see that I'm being summoned to another world as a phantom. Or Blantum, or Danny Phantom, as we like to call him. He's a phantom. <laughs> there you'll see all yeah. no eyes. And I have the sniffles. I uh, now we're gonna go conquer this bee. Let's go quick, because I think someone's trying to invade us again. Good. These fog walls are put up after a phantom comes into your world, whether it's friendly or uh Otherwise, benevolent. Uh friendly or malevolent? But no. Yeah. But what's this, is it? Liza Minnelli. Evil. <laughs> of course, stockbroker. Um, uh, it's to stop you from going to different places in the world. Each place is a set co op instance. Yeah. Oh, you're. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stand back. Ah! That was the scene. <laughs> Get out of there. Remember. Okay. Okay. <laughs> anyway, done. Uh, let's uh, let's head this way. You uh, you might recall from part something when we found the mystery key. Part of the past. That's it. Yeah, we. In the bottom on the description, we'll put a link to the past. God damn it! Get it? It's like that one game that Phil yells about a lot. Shit! Oh, okay. I'm gonna. Got it. Do. And this place is just a I joke just... for you to make me do more editing, isn't it? Anyway. <laughs> so, here's this guy. He's stuck in a cell. He's not happy about it. Let me throw this uh, out there real fast. As a phantom, you'll see I can't actually see his characters in there. I can just see that there is an NPC being represented. So. You cannot interact with other NPCs in people's worlds, which is really cool. If you're invading as well, you will not be able to harm his NPCs or talk to them or anything right. as such, which is cool. So, if you want to be a major tool, you can have other uh, other NPCs attack them. Force players to attack. Don't do uh, that. It's honestly that is kind of low. That's like I understand ganking because you can, but that that's where it starts getting. Yeah, that's ruining someone's game. I'm not gonna. Talk, I'm not gonna lie, but it, I, I do actually that have guy a, did a flippy do. stuck out because of it. Um, anyway, so we let that guy out of jail. Hopefully it's a good thing. You guys are still here? We're recording yeah. a video. And I'm here too. <laughs> All right. hey, what's really cool about this is he doesn't know how to take a hint. Um, <laughs> wow, man. <laughs> what are you guys recording? Dark Souls. Oh. Well. I can leave. Okay. Well, um, up here, uh, you're going to see a summon sign for... Nope, because we didn't unlock him. You're <laughs> Up here, you're going to find Solaire, uh, who you can, if you didn't yeah. kill him, you'll be able to see. Before we enter this fight, though, we should split it. Okay. So, uh, this was Chronicone. This is Old Noise, and Siridan, special guest. Yep, <laughs> for whatever reason. And uh, we will be right back.